Uh, Connors! Maybe a little early, aren't we? Babysitter canceled. I've got to go pick up my daughter. Connors, all work, no play, 24-7. That is my motto. You're late. I know. And I promise it won't happen again, okay? You always say that. Okay, time for bed, sweetie. I want Daddy. Is he coming to visit? Honey, I'm not sure. A subpoena? In the name of the state of Texas. Oh. Beautiful country out here, isn't it? Daddy! <laughs> oh, look at you! So, you couldn't just pick up the phone and call me. If you hadn't ignored the summons in the first place, I wouldn't have had to do all this. <sighs> Your Honor, our daughter, her whole life is back in New York. I just want shared custody. And now this is some kind of a revenge. Oh, my love for my daughter really revolves around a deep-rooted desire to see you suffer. Uh-huh, I knew it. Order, order. It is the observation of this court that both Mr. Hackett and Miss Connors have some issues to resolve. You went to court without a lawyer? Are you crazy? Would you go on a safari without a gun? He's insensitive. He behaves like a child. Uh, and he acts like this is just the simplest thing in the world. Why can't I just calm down and let's just be... Great to see you, Dad. Hey, Pop. Do you love her? Of course I love her. Then what's so complicated? I'm gonna let your mom answer that question. Your daddy and I, it's like we're from different worlds. But you're not from different worlds. Did you think it would bring us back together? If you could press a button that would make things go back to the way they were, would you press it? There's always going to be excuses, there's always going to be arguments, but those aren't reasons. Sometimes you just have to let go, live in the moment. I know I don't know a lot, but I do know this. I want Kelsey back in my life. But I also want you.